I am so impressed with the mistletones. I'm not surprised to see that the average rating on IMDb is 6.6 out of 10. This is a really engaging, entertaining film. And the soundtrack is incredible. This was released in 2012. It's currently on Disney+, Plus, which is where I watched it. Directed by Paul Hohen, written by Jed Elenoff and Scott Thomas. And stars Tia Maori as our protagonist, Holly. And I have to say my other favourite character in this is Larry, played by Jason Rogel. Absolutely loved the character of Larry. I thought he was brilliant. Tori Spelling, obviously fabulous, plays Marcy, uh, head of the Snowbells. And basically, Holly auditions to be part of the Snowbells, which is a very successful, very talented um, singing group. And... They are not very nice people, or certainly the ringleader is not a very nice person. She doesn't get in. So she decides to create a group of her own, mainly with co-workers. And it's all about them preparing for the uh, a competition. They're having a competition to see who gets to sing. Um, you know, they're all getting to sing Christmas songs to see who gets to sing on Christmas Eve. And obviously... That means that we're going to have some brilliant Christmas songs in here. And it is very festive. The soundtrack is beautifully Christmassy. And I really thoroughly loved it. Very well edited. Very well edited in terms of pacing as well. Because we have an entire montage of them rehearsing. And that could have become quite monotonous. Because it's just people rehearsing. It's not the actual performance. But I think it was put together very well. The sound editing as well. Everything flowed absolutely beautifully. Costumes were beautiful across the board gorgeous gorgeous costumes particularly with the final performances um they were were just stunning absolutely stunning the only thing that i didn't really invest in too much were the characters i felt like some of the characters were underdeveloped um maybe nick played by jonathan patrick moore nick is the kind of stuffy boss type who doesn't ever seem to have any fun or does he i just I feel like he was relatively developed until near the end. And then he made some decisions that just didn't feel like they'd had enough time to be developed to reach that point. So I wasn't very happy with some of his outcome. Holly, I felt like I didn't know that much about. But that's not, you know, it's not a massive deal. You don't need to know the ins and outs of a protagonist for a light-hearted comedic Christmas film. But I still didn't feel like I knew enough about her as I would have wanted. Larry, as I said, I I absolutely loved. Marcy was ridiculously annoying, but in a love-to-hate kind of way. That was something quite special to watch. In all, I really thoroughly enjoyed it. While I never thought it would be bad, I didn't expect that I would enjoy it quite as much as I did. Really, genuinely had a lot of fun with this one. Very festive, fabulous soundtrack, great performances. You know, the vocals as well are amazing. If you're looking for a fun Christmas film, Mistletones, although the name itself is cheesy, the film itself is very well put together, a lot of fun, and one that I am really happy to recommend.